The proposed partnership between the FAO and CropLife International goes against FAO's mandate. The FAO is a UN agency that is bound by international human rights framework and must serve public interest and give centrality to small scale food producers and to workers through the food systems, not to big corporations. In addition to announcing a partnership with CropLife, last December the FAO also adopted a new strategy for engagement with the private sector. This new strategy focuses more on attracting funding for FAO than on protecting its mandate and integrity. The strategy includes several ambiguous rules. Therefore, their interpretation can lead to different conclusions on how to protect FAO's mandate. In the case of crop life, because of the ambiguity of these rules, some parties may say that the alliance is in line with FAO new strategy. However, what may seem legal under the new strategy will still be unjust because crop life could use the alliance to influence governance spaces in countries where FAO is active. This would create further power asymmetries between pesticides companies and small scale food producers in policy making and undermine advocacy for the transition to most, more just, healthy and sustainable food systems based on agroecology. The new private sector engagement strategy may open the door for the creation of more alliances similar to the one with crop life, and this first would create a harmful precedent. We therefore urge FAO member states to ending the proposed alliance with crop, crop life and to review the strategy to ensure that it clearly puts human rights above economic interests.